Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Citadel Forge with Fire on the Radio Man 03. And you can bet it's awesome to have you along doing a little weekend record for you today and having some fun in the game. I've been doing some grind work. Uh, also, just got a bear. Yeah, just uh, tamed up a level 9 bear. Trouble. So I figure we're going to take Sheila and Trouble with us today. And we've got to get pixie dust. That's like my main goal today is pixie dust so that we can get the broom. So that I can take the broom up on some of these higher mountains and find that precious stone and get a hold of it. Also in the comments it was mentioned, and thank you for the support of the series and for the comments. I appreciate those very much. Uh, if we go to the map, we have a guy we're supposed to go see, the elderly assistants. I feel like maybe I should run over there and do that. You guys say it's a good idea to do some of these quests and get them because they give you some nice stuff. So uh, maybe we'll walk over that direction today with, uh, with the Thames and see if we can't, um, you know, get into some trouble and stuff like that. I was just looking at... I've opened up several things. You can see I'm a level 16 now. Just, just doing grind work. Crafting, grinding is all I've been doing at the moment. And I put a roof on. I had to put a p pillar in the middle of the room here in order to get the roof to attach. Um, eh, it's not the best. I thought this would disappear and blend in with the rest of these here, but it, it didn't do that. So I guess, I guess I, I don't remember that right. I thought it made just one solid pillar, but it looks to me like it has these, um, uh, these supports that pop out on the sides all the way up. Uh, I've been making iron. Let's see what's in the chest. That's what I've got in the chest. 1600 wood. I got some iron ingots made. I've got some gold ingots made. And uh, other than that, just, just like I said, gather, 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 gather. So we've got 47 mana potions, 46 health potions in our hot bar that we can use. Uh, thank you for also letting me know that the um, extraction spells, the spells in general, do eventually run out. So you do have to put essence back into your tools to recreate that um particular spell that you have because they do wear out so you can see now that I've almost run down the uh, extraction spell in our new axe that we made last episode so that's the thing what I think is really cool also what I did was I turned the gamma up a little bit more as well as the brightness so this is our nighttime right now I do have some white torches that I built and put in here so it lightens this room up quite a bit uh, so I hope that works I wanted to see something really quick we have Another workbench available to us. We've got the deconstructor, which is nice to be able to put up eventually. Uh, workbench, uh, here it is. The tailor bench is need wood and rune crystal. I think I need that in order to make, I've learned the leather armor. Let's see here. Hide leg wraps, tailor bench, yeah. And then it's gonna take what? 18 hide and 12 crystal. I don't think I even have a lot of hide on me right now. We can take these guys, though, and these guys. And we can make that. And let's get it set up so we can at least get ready to start uh, getting our new um, armor. Better armor. Uh, escape. So, refined leather is leather. Okay, I see. Refined cloth is just cloth. Okay, if I remember that, that's, I remember all that correctly. So if I come down here, where's the helmet that I just learned? Huh. Hide chest piece, 25 to, we got the hide leg wraps. I don't know the boots yet. Next level, I'm going to learn the boots so we have a complete set of armor. I'm trying to figure out where the hat is for this right now. requires forge oh okay I see oh and then it requires some leather as well okay so 11 leather just to make the skull cap what about the, um, the pants what do I have for hide on me I don't have much I know that I've had 20 on me eh, let's take that can't take all of that okay let's grab that out of here oh Sometimes it lags a little bit when you're dragging things in and out of here. There we go. I think that's what I needed. If I could get a couple pieces of the hide armor made, that would be really nice. 
hind leg wraps. I can make one of those. And also, thank you for answering me. The question is, if I made like two or three different hide leg wraps, it's possible that one of them will have better stats than the other. So it's important to look at the stats too. You're going to hear me say that, but then I'm going to forget to look. <laughs> so we've got some hide leg wraps coming in. Uh, no, don't cancel. This is taking a little bit of damage. It's like 16 days. And what does it mean by close all doors? I'm not quite sure what that means. If, if, if Is it my doors or is there like uh, teleportal type doors type things going on? That's, that's what I'm curious about. When it says close all the doors. I'll have to figure that out or you guys will tell me in the comments. Alright, so we've got that. Oh, I can't. My inventory is full. All right, and now we can enter. There we go. An inventory. Let's put those guys on right there. There we go. 34 armor. They're epic. It says right there, epic. So I think that's as good as they get, right? Like this guy here is just uncommon. Uncommon. But this one right here, leg wraps, turned out to be epic. <laughs> nice. Okay, so let's go in here again. Uh, we have a hide chest piece. I need okay, so I need to get hide. So while we're out and about today, we need to see about getting some fairy dust. We need ten to make the broom. And uh, we need some more hide. And we should be good to get the rest of our stuff kind of put together. because uh, we don't even have enough hide to make the leather now, so we'll just throw all that stuff in there. And I I think what I'm going to do is grab the Thames and head out of the door. Now, oh, you know what? I put a bunch of wood in here, didn't I? Give me all that. Yeah, give me all that right there. I want all that in here. There we go. There we go. Okay. I think we're ready to go. The pig will stay here. It's 12.24 a.m. I'm going to walk it. Uh, just nice and easy like. Follow defensive. Follow defensive. You know what? Real quick. Hold on. Let's uh, stay in defensive. Uh, one other thing I wanted to see. I think it's this bench right here that we needed. Uh, maybe not. Maybe it's just the workbench for the saddle. That was broomstick. Oh, there it is, right here. What do I need to craft the saddle? It doesn't show me. It's not showing you in here. Oh, there it is. There it is. 20 leather. Okay, so the leather, we, we need hide and we need fairy dust. Okay, that's, that's simple enough, right? Hide and fairy dust is what we need. So I'm hoping these guys are going to level up a little bit while we're out and about today. Trying to uh, deal with um, what's going on in the world. We'll see. Let's see. Can they both uh, get over here to me? They can. All right. Beautiful. All right. I'm going to head out the door. I'll bring you back when something exciting is going on. But I think I updated you on everything we've got going on at the moment. So hopefully you're caught up on that. I think I'll be picking up the crowberry and the... Uh, uh, is it ghostberry? I can never remember that one. I think it's the ghostberry. I'll pick those up too, just because you need them for so many things, uh, especially the potions. Super helpful. Ghost orchid. Duh. Ghost orchid. Try to remember that so I'm speaking clearly of what it is I'm doing. Ghost orchid is the blue flower. I've also started picking up the rune crystals in the ground too, just because we need those for the potions as well quite a few so it's best to just keep picking this stuff up I've not come across anything to hunt oh there's an elk okay good deal there's two hide Yeah, at the beginning here, I think it's best to be down in this area doing our hunting and foraging and stuff like that just because it's the lower level and we are low level. 
Although I have to say, I've leveled pretty quickly, I think. I feel like I have, anyways. And I think we've got the gamma kind of set and the brightness set in a way that you guys can see better, too, now. So that's good. Well, there's like a bridge, a stone bridge going out to that island right there. Oh, look at that. That's pretty cool. I prefer being in first person. Yo. Two pelts. Okay, that's not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for the hide, not the pelts. I feel a little better having two tames with me as opposed to just one. I feel like together they can work pretty well together. Hopefully they'll level up together as well. I think I might have gotten a little off track of where I'm supposed to be going. Here we go, this way. Ooh, there's a beauty. Horse. Pretty. I want one of those, too. So with this new add-on, uh, add this new world or dimension or whatever you want to call it that they've added to the game, there's new tames in there, too. Two more. Nice. Take all the hide we can get. Mm -mm 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 -mm. So we have an encampment down here, it looks like. Is this where we're headed? No, we've got to go past this encampment. So I don't want to mess with the encampment yet if we don't have to. Let's try to go around. Okay, I see it's over here. Stretches over to here. I think there's a cave underneath here. We've got another wolf over here. What's this here? Helpers have run away. What the heck is going on? Why isn't my guys fighting what they're supposed to? They're, they're down here fighting these guys. What is going on? Oh, they killed the wolf already. What is she going over there for? I don't understand that. I, I didn't send it over there or nothing. It's kind of stupid. I don't know why. The wolf went that way. It doesn't make any sense at all. Now we've lost the wolf. We lose that bear too. How do I get him to follow me? Oh, he's coming out of there. He came out. Okay, so let's get away and see if he'll follow. Doggone it, man. I don't know why it's doing that, why the wolf went down into that area and fought like that. It doesn't make any sense to me at all. Come on, Trouble, what the heck, man?
I don't think that should have happened. He's almost dead. The wolf is dead. Man. You need to heal up. Took another shot. <laughs> I wonder if we activated one accidentally and uh, it got a shot off at uh, the wolf and that's why it did that. I don't know. All I know is they, they wander off, it seems like, a little bit too much for me. Who's shooting? These guys are still shooting at us. Come on, bear. We just get the feel for this fighting, that's all. We just gotta get a feel for it. Okay, your health is coming up. You're doing okay. There we go. Oh. <laughs> Looks just awful. <laughs> oh my gosh, the carnage is real. Okay, I forgot there's like a pixie little place right here. I think this is a, a fairy, actual fairy nest. We just killed them all. Let's go grab their loot. Oh, I see you got a hole to open. An ingot and a piece of bread. <sighs> I'm a little disappointed that we lost our wolf. I, I won't lie about that. I'm a little disappointed we lost the wolf. It's not the first one. It's not going to be the last one either. Uh, where's our guy at? Why can't I seem to... <laughs> I need to find him. 140 meters. Just went the wrong way. So how much fairy dust do we have now? <sighs> Five out of the ten we need. Uh, bummer. Uh, did I finish looting everybody here? Looks like I missed one. Maybe not. Maybe not. So these orcs are right up here at the top of the path. That's probably why they got aggroed onto the wolf. Ah, here he is. Here's a cave. Ah, I see, I see. Oh, this is pretty. Look at this place. Awesome. Stay right there, Trouble. Hmm. What fascinating findings in this cave. Oh, I seem to have a visitor. Hmm, hmm. Hmm. Welcome, Traveler. My name is Gimbak, one of the few remaining priests of Nishan. I've been wistfully wandering these woods of Ignis for most of my days. This cave and others seem to have formed more recently and stranger yet have the scrawlings of an ancient language I studied while training for the Nishan Order. In my, in my advancing age, I cannot afford to waste time with the unproven. If you seek wisdom and knowledge, gain some basic experience in return. Prepare to proceed on an epic adventure. Oh, achieve level 10. There we go. 
I knew you would return successful. You have a particularly confident and determined aura, not easily discouraged by moderate effort or tribulation. One often finds that the more effort they put in, the easier it becomes to match and exceed that level over time. Let us now proceed with the findings in this cave. Hmm. Force defeated. While you've been getting more accustomed to life in Ignis, I was able to take a closer look at some of these writings. These glyphs in particular proceed rather ominously. A great evil will soon engulf Ignis and must be defeated. Sadly, most great factions were destroyed during the War of the Houses, and Ignis simply does not have the capacity to mount a resistance. We will clearly need to develop our combat skills to survive this threat. Indeed we do. Perhaps you could try against a rather basic creature like a boar. Okay, I gotta go kill a boar, huh? He's got a chest, chest, treasure chest in here, so let's go see if we can go kill that boar like he wants us to do. You know, I would have thought a level 19 wolf would last a little bit longer, but I guess she probably got involved in that fight and had been in there with three, four of those guys just tearing into her like that. Didn't stand much of a chance. I did not know. It's unfortunate. It's all right, we'll get another one. We got her kind of cheap-like anyways. Now we can go fight those pixies again at 6 a.m. and 6 p.m. The um, those little bases that we fought the pixies at, those things respawn with the creatures there. There you go. Good job, bear. Crowberry seed. There you go. You gonna do something about that? He's <laughs> okay. The animals don't seem to be very responsive here. Oh, he's got it. He's got it. He's got it. Fell right through the world. Got some essence over here. Looks like a dark essence right here. I don't know that I've ever seen this before. Yeah, there's dark essence right here too. Where are we at in the map? Let's see. We're south of where our quest is, huh? Natural healing pool. Bear stuck in a rock, just like the wolf was getting stuck in a rock. I thought maybe he'd teleport to me, but I got a little ways away and he's not coming to me, so... Hold on. Almost got you out of there. You're free. He's leveled, uh, I think, twice since we've been out with him. Got the boar, so now I think we head back to the question mark? We do, yeah. Okay, let's go on up this way, I think. Is going to be the way out of here? I don't know. We'll soon find out. There we go. Could not get the aim down. <laughs> okay, we should be close now. We're back out on the street. I'm hoping maybe we'll come across those pixies again, those fairies, that, that little camp. i got to remember where it is now, somewhere around here. 
and then we'll kill them. And we should have enough of the dust to get us the broom so that we can take the broom and go get the precious stones so we can make some of the jewelry and things like that, the trinkets that are going to help us out with our banner and everything. So, you know, checks and balances, right, people? Checks and balances. Gotcha, finally. Awesome. There we go. Nice. Nice work. How's our bear doing? Trouble's doing pretty good. He's uh, level 11, and he's got his health all back already, which is fantastic. So where is our guy's cave? Again. I've lost it. I think I'm uh, just over this ridge here. It's interesting. I'm in this area for a little bit, and I notice that there's more and more um, things to hunt that just start to, to spawn in, you know? Oh, there's a bird. Take that bird. go we got an egg and some poultry there's another bear I guess I wouldn't mind having a couple more bears you know three bears would be kind of nice to have as well we'll have to see what we wind up with I do enjoy taming the animals it's the fun part for me one of the fun parts an important victory regardless of size this is just the beginning it is said that when Ignis is at its most vulnerable and evil tightens its grip the God King summons an individual who possesses the skills and determination to restore peace and order to the land. They are forged with the fire and power of his blood, which flows like lava through their veins. <clears throat> Bears defeated. Okay. Appearance of these glyphs cannot be random or pointless. They are cryptic messages only interpreted by the highest academics, such as myself and a few acquaintances, and obviously the one who scribed the message. Translating the glyphs is easier for some than others, depending on their lives of education and magical abilities. Although I am able to understand these glyphs with ease, the state of my body does not facilitate travel as it once did. Enough about me. If evil must be defeated, perhaps you should take a stab at defeating a more robust creature, such as a bear. Alright. Trouble, you ready? He's out here. He's all anxious to kill a bear. We just saw one, didn't we? Gotcha. Another fairy dust. Let's see if we can pull this one over here.
Fairy's dead. And we should have what we need now. We have 14. Ha, nice. Okay, this is a good spot to remember. Definitely to come for the fairy dust. At least twice a day you can come here and get the fairies then. And the chest is still open, so the chest did not reset. But the fairies did, so that was good. We still need to catch and kill... Still need to kill a bear. There's a bear. How's, uh, how's his... No, his health is great. He's almost up to a thousand hit points now. The wolf had quite a few more than that, though. I want him to get the kill, hopefully. I'm not taking much damage from the bear. There we go. Something happened there. Ooh, trouble jumped up to a level 12 now. Nice. Bear's defeated one. There we go. All right, that took care of that. Next quest, this next part of the quest. Be nice if we get a saddle for um, our bear too. Make a saddle for him. This is a neat little spot next to this river right here. I do like that fire spell. It just and this thing is just the the I have to say the wand is. Very direct. It's just boof. It's right there. You know, I, I like the way it fires. I, I may change my mind on what it is I'm using here. I don't know if I'm going to tame any more wolves. I just keep losing them. There you go. Oh, nice. We go past the pixie spot here. Yep, this is where you go to get your pixie dust. Early game, for sure. Right over here. That worked out really smooth. It's pretty cool. Alright, then our guy should be just up here around this corner. We'll see what he wants us to do next. Stay and defensive. What do you got on you for time now? 12 hours and 39 minutes, huh? Let's go ahead and feed you a little bit more. We'll give you that poultry. And we'll give you those meat right there. Alright, there you go. You're set with some more meat. Let's go see what this guy wants now. Nature is never really defeated, just temporarily converted from one from to another in a great circle. I have seen many examples of this during my time here in Ignis. Bear defeated. There we go. The priests of Nishan had a profound influence in the land of Ignis. Our magic was used for good and convenience. We built towers and travel portals for weary travelers. We created zones of safety around the ruins of ancient houses. We even built the giant metaphorical statue of the God King in the north as a tribute to good. There have always been forces working to destroy what we have accomplished, and now that our numbers are few, the apparent return of these forces is even more worrying. Developing your combat skills is of critical importance. You should try your hand at clearing the creatures in Solomon's Cave. Solomon's Cave, huh? Solomon's Cave. There you go. Good job, buddy. Kill that skeleton. Nice work, Trouble. Nice work. 
I'm gonna take advantage of this area. It's got a lot of food in it. Oh, he ran off. Ooh, this looks promising. There's a thing here. Some kind of a, 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 a glyph thing. Well, I'm not sure what this is. Monolith of Protection, 20, 25 armor and 50 health for 60 minutes. I'm going to put him down here a little bit further. Over here. Stay there defensive. I'm also going to drop off my stuff onto the bear. Oh, not that. Okay. Let's go ahead and refill our mana. Level up again. And then there's just three boars in here we gotta take care of. Oh, there's rune crystals on the floor too. It's really cool. Gives the whole room a neat little sparkle to it. Can I use this on the, the, this? This doesn't seem to work very well at all on these guys. go. Nice. Ooh, three chests too, really. Awesome. Alright, we got some, ooh, apprentice padded armor. Nice. Apprentice conjurer's gauge. Now if we can't use these or we don't want to use them, we can use the deconstructor once we have that made. A magic necklace. Plus one health, apprentice boots. Oh my gosh! So let's go, let's go. Uh, well, let's let's go loot these other animals, and then we'll leave the cave. Oh man, that's some, that's cool. That's like free armor right there. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. That makes me very happy. We're just now learning that ourselves, so it's pretty handy that all of a sudden now we've we've actually got it something we can put on. More hide, baby. More hide. Here's another one. Okay, this is turning into a pretty good outing here. I feel like I'm going to push my luck, though, if I'm not careful. I should be able to call him over to me. Oh, i got to add some more stuff to me. What should I be getting this damage up to? Let me know what you think. Follow. There he comes. That's really a handy little key to have right there. Uh, let's go to our inventory. Can I wear this? There we go. We're getting our health back faster. Apprentice boots. Got an apprentice shirt. 
Diluted Mana Flask. Regen regenerates 150 mana. We can throw that into a Deconstructor and get rid of it. What's this here? Yellow Dye. Weapons, armor, and some brooms. I see. Oh, look at this. We're looking pretty good. We just don't have the helmet. So this is just common, huh? Those are common as well. We, we could make more. We could make them. We could make them now. So that's nice. Oh, they're just clashing. Oh, look at that. I was waiting for you to finish them off, but you didn't do it. It's like those fairies are back. I'm going to go ahead and do it one more time here and kill them all again. Awesome. I love having the bear with me. So far, he's my favorite. We got him up to a, just over a thousand hit points now. He's level 13, so he's actually been coming up pretty good. I've got some points to spend, but I'm going to wait a little bit until I can uh, sit down and really think about it. Go back to base and do that. I'm feeling a little more powerful, and I'm liking this wand. I'm really liking the wand. Oh, there's another fairy. some kind of a slowdown spell on this guy. He can't move as fast. I see. Well, it was worth three fairy dust off that one. That's awesome. Hunting the fairies at night, I guess, huh? Kicking some pixie dust. <laughs> I'm probably going to take a break here to go eat. Everybody's got some uh, lunch going on for us. It's Saturday afternoon right now. I'm planning on playing... Uh, for the day. I may record a couple of episodes, actually. Uh, he's going to stand there defensively. Thank you very much, Trouble. You did a great job today. He's just been amazing. Mm -hmm. Well done. They never stood a chance. Caves are often full of valuable resources. I hope you were able to obtain some for yourself or a friend. I was, as a matter of fact. He's the main quest. More, huh? Fresh berry salads obtained. You have proven your worth as a warrior, but often battles leaves one weak and weary. Effective recovery is a critical part of a sustainable response to evil. There are some basic recovery recipes available to you at present. Obtain and craft the resources for some fresh berry salads as practice. Fresh berry salads? Are you kidding me? Can I make one of those now? Mm. You've proven your worth as a warrior, but often battle leaves one weak and weary. Oh. Fresh berry salads obtained. Accept. Okay. There's some basic recovery. Okay. Accept. Okay. Now. Oh, I see. I had to wait for it to finish. Okay. These salads are great for gently restoring mana, but be sure to study other recipes for more beneficial rewards. Some recipes will leave you with an extra spring in your step. I was wondering about that. I bet there's some food items in here that are pretty darn good. Um... Let's go ahead and open The one who scribed these glyphs refers to the practice of meditating for visions. We Nishan priests would enter meditative states for days on end, achieving deep states of trance with lucid visions of the past, present, and future. 
Only under ideal conditions can we maintain the trance. Silence and darkness provide the necessary mental isolation. We often awaken famished, desiring a hearty meal with substance. These meals are suitable for warriors as well, so perhaps you should attempt to craft some. Bring me a salted boar to showcase the combination of hunting and crafting. Okay, we'll take that and we'll, we'll do that uh, another time. We'll come back and do that. Let's go ahead and get this guy home. I want to see about getting some of that precious stone put together. So we can have uh, that taken care of. Get our, our broom made so we can travel a little bit further, a little bit faster. Starting to feel a little more, a little more um, powerful, just a little bit. Yeah, we're back. It's been a couple hours since the last time I was on. Let's see what we've got. We've got the fairy dust, which we needed, and I think I needed some wood as well. For the broom? Let's see what we need for this this here broom. We're looking at uh, flying around on broomstick. I need 20 rune crystals. I know I've got that as well. Can't take all of that. So we're going to drop those in first, and then we'll drop that in. There we go. That should be enough to get us a broomstick. Broomstick. All right, that's crafting. I th think that's all I was at. Well, hold on a second. At the forge, trinkets, uh, intricate magic ring, primitive magic ring. Uh, the intricate magic ring would be nice to have, but I need amethyst crystal, and I don't even know where to get that. Primitive magic ring, we need three iron ingot. I'd have a ring on. I think that's the one I wanted. Let's take a look and see. Intricate magic ring. Okay, this is going to give me one plus mana per second. Maybe I make this one now, and then until I can find the other stuff, you guys let me know where I can actually find it in the world. Oh, we can grab the boots here, too. We do that. Um, and maybe I'll just make this primitive magic ring for the time being. We've got the necklace on now, which is pretty cool. Uh, what did I need? Just a few ingot, right? Back to here. What did it show? Oh, flawless gems. Okay. Primitive magic ring. Let's craft one of those up too. Our broom is finished. There we go. Inventory. Let's right click that into where it goes. Right over there. Alright. Oh, fantastic. Oh, it looks like I can only care. Well, hold on. We've got a couple of things down here. Well, that's giving me my, all my stats. I see. There we go. I'm going to put the points that I had there into those. We've got our broom now. We're going to need lots of mana now because the broom takes mana to use. I'm not even sure how to use the, uh, the broom at the moment. But we'll see if we can fly up someplace and find some precious stone, which is what we need the broom for. Back to inventory. Ah, I put that... Okay, that replaced the necklace. That's one health, but we want the mana, so... Okay, we're going to do that instead. Uh, let's go ahead and throw this necklace in here. These are things we could deconstruct down the road if we want to. You guys let me know if it's a better thing to keep on or not. Thirteen of those left, okay. Is it F? Yeah, F. F is what we use to fly the broom. But you can see it's going to suck down that mana pretty good. Uh, I wonder if I would get lucky to find some precious stone up on these hills closest to us. Let's see. Hold down left. Shift. 
to fly faster. Oh, on top of the world, ladies and gentlemen. On top of the world now. Let's see if there's any uh, precious stone up here. So far, I'm not feeling too lucky. But up from up here, we might be able to see where there's some for us to get to. Very dust. Give it to me. Let's, uh, let's go up one more height. Let's go up a little bit higher. One more height. Let's go up one more level here. I'm surprised I've not run into the precious stone yet. It's getting dark as well. Ooh, we should probably open this portal up, huh? I don't see anybody guarding it. Oh, there's a bed up here. Oh, there's a guy up here too. Helgi. Okay. Awesome. Okay, there's tons of quests in here. That's really awesome. Lots of stuff to do, it looks like. I'm not looking for quests right now, but we've still got to finish up the old guy's stuff. We can definitely open this fast travel up. All right, let's go back down. I'm going to keep looking for precious stone. I'll bring you back when I find some and we get some, but we need it to uh, move forward here. Ah, here it is. There's a 31 flame dragon. You guys say wyvern. And then there's a forest guardian up here too. But this is the precious stone. At least it's some precious stone. Let's keep those guys over there so we can watch them. I'm going to grab this stuff up and uh, hold on to it. They have sort of a celestial look to them. Careful, big guy. Made me a little nervous. We're of course in an area that's got higher level creatures. Get up here so I can see them both. Last thing I want is that wyvern getting up here and setting me on fire. There he goes. They're fast too, you know? They're just fast. He sees me. Oh, God, he's like, Oh, yeah, I can fly too, buddy. Oh, God. Oh! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Uh, 
we need that precious stone in order to um, put our spawn stone down. Doggone it. <laughs> okay. All right, I'm going to try to go back and grab up our stuff that we lost. Hopefully, we can get back up there and do that. We still have our broom and everything, so that's good. We just lost the stuff that was in our inventory so far. Ay, ay, ay. Here goes nothing. I think we're up on top of that mountain peak right there in front of me. We are going to go for it and see if we can get our stuff that we've dropped. If anything else, get some more of that precious stone. Doggone it. We had it. And now I know. The Wyvern's got quite a little bit of a, a blast radius around them that they can hit you from. Oh, God. Oh, wow. Doesn't take long at all for them to just wipe you completely out. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, I'm just going to try to go back up there again and, and get that stuff. If anything else, I've got to get the uh, that precious stone. That's really interesting. The creatures up there are much, much more difficult than I anticipated they would be. So, um... I think I'm going to call an episode right there. I've got a lot to do. i got to try to get back and get our stuff. Precious stone. Looks like our hat was destroyed in that last attack. Caused damage to our stuff. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, uh, not a big deal. We're learning things, that's for sure. We've got a few things that we didn't have before, so I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, hit the like button for me. Comment, subscribe, and share. I'm the Radio Man 3 have an awesome, a fantastic, and a superb day, and I look forward to talking to you again next time.